Andrea was in here last. I can't get my legs in. Ooh. This is going to be the first time I've driven a car in four weeks. First mistake. Keep the keys in your pocket whilst getting into the car. That's never good. All right, let's see whether it's going to start. Well, that's a good sign. Right, so it is lunchtime, midday, and I am just about to nip off and grab some fuel for the car. Also, I'm taking it for its first drive in over a week just to keep it running and ticking over nicely. Uh, main reason, just in case I need to uh, take any supplies to my folks because they are on self-isolation as well. They're not even leaving the house at all. So that's important. And uh, other than that, I was planning to do some paving over the Easter weekend. However, all of those sorts of DIY shops have shut down. So that is futile. Looks like I'm just going to have to relax. But I am going to try and buy some soil so I can do some planting. Um, why not, hey? Spring's here. Got to make the most of the good weather while it... I can't believe it's actually good weather at the moment in the UK. I'm not going to complain. Right, that's the fuel done. Let's see whether we can get the compost. to get that some compost and also can finish off my boulder now which I've been meaning to do for about a year right well that's my lunchtime trip done got the compost that I needed the car's still running gonna leave it running probably for another 10 minutes just so that it's good I when I started it again at the garage it didn't like it so much so uh, I mean to be expected I guess it's just sitting there dormant at the moment Anyway, that's what I'm up to, gardening at the weekend. I've got to go back to work in a minute. But uh, what are you guys up to? What are you doing at the moment or at the weekend to fill your time stuck at home? Five bags for £10. Not bad. Well, I heard rumoured that the Prime Minister was going to send a letter to everyone and I have received my one, so... Uh, that's cool. Unfortunately, he's gone into intensive care, so uh, that's less cool. But um, nonetheless, uh, the letter is explaining all the rules and what they're doing to try and uh, contain the virus. So, uh, yeah, not anything we didn't already know, but it's nice to receive the letter given we're stuck indoors at this point in time. What in the world is going on? 